A bus slammed into some oncoming traffic on US 19 in Palm Harbor today. News Channel H. Jamel Lene joins us live tonight. She's near Nebraska Avenue where the lanes have finally reopened. Well, good afternoon. I can show you the bus driver, FHP tells me, crashed into several vehicles on that side of the road hop the median and crash into several more cars. Now those in the path of this driver said it was a scary moment. George Sarwin says he imagined the worst when he saw this PSTA bus coming straight towards him Thursday afternoon. I feel very lucky. Uh, a foot over, I, he would caught me right in the front with my airbags imploding and I would have taken a hit. The driver had a medical emergency as he approached the intersection of US 19 and Nebraska Avenue in Palm Harbor. You don't push a car in the intersection, turn it around, bounce off of the median, slide by me, and hit four more cars going 25 miles an hour. FHP says he slammed into eight vehicles. The driver in this Volkswagen sandwiched in between. Crawled out. Walking around like I am right now, refused to uh, go to hospital. Uh, un you see the car, unbelievable. Those he hit noticed him slumped over the wheel. A couple of us jumped out of our vehicles, pried the door open. Uh, we shut down the bus and got him out of his seatbelt, got him on the floor, and some deputies were able to give him CPR. The crash shut down US 19 for hours. Luckily, only few injuries. This could have been so much worse. No one got seriously hurt, fortunately. And we've been told that there were several other injuries, but they appear to be minor. As for that bus driver, we've learned he's in critical condition. In Palm Harbor, Jamel and A, News Channel 8.